Hello everyone, today we're going to be talking about installing Performance Center, a component of CA Performance Management 2.8. There are some prerequisites to installing the software, including operating system requirements, root or sudo access, the number of open files in limits.conf, verifying that TCP ports are open, time synchronization is configured, and that UTF-8 support is configured. For more information on this, please see wiki.ca.com. Okay, I've copied over the installation file into my temp folder here. I'm going to go ahead and extract it. And then we're going to make the actual installation file itself executable. And then we're going to run that file. And what I'm going to do is add a command line argument here, dash I console. And what that command line argument does is specifies that we are on a system with no windowing. And we're going to run everything from the command line. The installer will now uh, install a JRE and we're simply going to follow along with the installation prompts. The first thing we're going to do is select the language. We're then going to scroll through the end user licensing agreement. Agree to it. The installation program will now show us whether our host meets the system requirements. In this case, 16 gig of memory and four cores. We can now choose where we're going to install the software. I'm going to choose the default. We can now decide if we're going to modify the amount of memory given for each service that comprises CA performance management. We're now going to choose the memory for the services that comprise CA performance center. I'm going to stick with the defaults. In some larger environments, you may want to modify these. New for 2.8 is the ability to have CA Performance Center monitored by CA Application Performance Management. I'm going to choose not to configure this at this time. I'm going to choose the directory for the data. I'm going to choose the temp database directory. And now I'm going to be able to review everything that we've chosen. I'll press enter to continue and the installation will begin. We've now successfully installed Performance Center. We can hit enter to exit the installer. We can now verify that CA Performance Center is installed correctly by going to its web page. Once we've logged in, we can go to the help, about, and verify the version. 